Hi guys, this is my year 2000 Honda Civic. It cost me £400 and for the last eight weeks I've been spending about four nights of the week sleeping in it. I'll, uh, I'll show you the setup I use uh, for sleeping in it and just generally living. Uh, open up the back seats, I'll show you how I deploy the sleeping system. Just pull up the, uh, the seat, as you see it's pretty dirty, it is lived in. Pop those two seats down, pull the pillow out, pull the sleeping bag out and good to go. It takes about 10 seconds and you're ready to sleep. I'll show you from the boot. So as you can see, it's kind of hard to see on camera but I've got the sleeping bag in a diagonal direction so it goes up from behind the driver's seat back down to the passenger side football. Uh, the reason for that is if I had it straight on, it's actually just a little bit too short. I'm five foot ten and I wouldn't just sort of squeeze in there. But if you have it diagonally, I reckon you could probably fit people up to about six foot one sleeping in there. Uh, just my clothes hold all. Uh, got some canned food, which um, just been shopping at Sainsbury's. Uh, these are great potatoes in water, dead cheap, 20p a can. Uh, loads of those loads of those got some grapefruit and peaches and stuff like that for the morning in there as well uh, just some food over here these pita breads are great just just all your vegan your vegan foods really uh, avoid the meat a for the animals and b it's just gonna go it's just gonna go bad in a car if you stick with vegan stuff you're not really gonna get food poisoning at all and uh, and yeah that's my setup so I've been loving it yeah for the last eight weeks about four four or five nights a week I've been staying in the car uh, and yeah, it's been e easy as pie really, technically homeless at the moment. Um, I've just moved up to a new area for a new job and uh, yeah, just been living in the car, go back to the parents and that on the weekend. But easy man, easy. If you've got a car, you're sound, there's no problem at all. I mean, an estate car would probably be a little bit more optimal than just a hatchback. But yeah, it's easy. So anybody out there uh, living in a car, um, I'd love to see the way you do it, share tips and uh, I'll see you in the next video.